Today's CNC FAQ is what post processor do I need to use for my Stepcraft machine in Vetric programs? Now this includes Vetric, VCarve, uh, Desktop and Pro, Cut 2D, Cut 3D, and Photo VCarve. So what's gonna happen is you're designing in your Vetric program and it doesn't matter whether you're designing in uh, metric measurements or imperial measurements, inches, uh, the post processor's job is to convert your design into a format that the Stepcraft can understand. Now, it just so happens that the Stepcraft machine and UC CNC work in metric. So even if you design a file in imperial measurements, the post processor will convert that so that the G code outputs in metric. So on the Stepcraft, uh, we're gonna use, if you have a new version of uh, Vetric programs, uh, there is a Stepcraft post processor. There's actually two. There's a, uh, a Stepcraft UCCNC ARCS uh, post processor that's, that's in millimeters in parentheses and it'll say .txt. And then there's a Stepcraft UCCNC ATC ARCF in millimeters .txt. Now, those are the two that you would look for first, I would guess, uh, if you have a newer version. The ATC version is if you have, if you're using a uh, Stepcraft automatic tool changer, then that's gonna put G code in there that will tell the uh, tool changer which tool you're gonna actually use for your job. If you don't have an automatic tool changer, then you're just gonna use the normal ARCS, the one without the ATC. Now, if you don't see a Stepcraft post processor in your list, then the fallback is the Mach 2 slash 3 ARCS millimeter dot TXT or the Mach 2 slash 3 ATC ARCS uh, millimeters. Uh, now, be careful because in the Mach, there is also an inches uh, version of the post processor. So you want to make sure that you've selected the, the one that has the millimeter in parentheses. So that's it for today's CNC FAQ.